Howdy folks, happy Sunday morning. Got a special tune for you this morning. Gonna play it on the old tenor banjo here and kazoo. And uh, this is not a homemade instrument as you can probably see. However, I kind of lump it in the same category because when I got it, it was not in playable condition. And Lou LaManna, my buddy, he helped me get this back to playable condition and I would not have been able to do that without him. And I met him through my cigar box guitar hobby. So it all kind of ties together. And of course this kazoo, I did a video about this. This is from Black Owl Guitars. It's a kazoo kit that I built. Um, really great little kazoo. And I'm gonna use them both today to do this classic train song that uh, has been covered about a million times. So gonna do it today. Hopefully you guys like it for Sunday morning. A little uh, wreck of the old 97. for you guys. Happy Sunday morning. And now for the story behind this great tune. So this is actually a based on a true story. So uh, the, the old 97 was a train back in the day, a steam engine <clears throat> that ran the mail line. And uh, it was actually called, nicknamed the fast mail because it was almost never late. And uh, the old 97 had come down from Washington, D.C. to Monroe, Virginia. And it was an hour behind when it got there. And it changed crews in Monroe. And the, the engineer was a um, man by the name of Steve Brody. And uh, he took control of that. And the railroad told him, get that thing to Spencer on time. Now, the accident investigator said that the average speed for a steam train on that route would have been 39 miles an hour. That's the average from, uh, from Monroe to Spencer. Okay, and that's uh, Spencer's almost, uh, Spencer is, is in North Carolina, Monroe is in Virginia. So going basically down that way. And it's more or less a straight shot. However, there is like a 90 degree dog leg when you hit the, the town of Danville and it was a trestle. And so for that reason, it was a really hard route because you couldn't get up too much speed until you went around that, that trestle or you were going to derail on that trestle. So their plan was, the crew's plan was, they were gonna heat that baby up, get it rolling, slow it back down, get around that, that corner, and then get all the way down to, uh, to Spencer on time, heat it back up. And to do that, again, the accident investigator said they would have had to average 51 miles an hour. So that is 12 miles an hour over what that train normally did, which in a steam engine, that's a big deal, especially with that much weight. So 
you can see where this went is uh, they came around that 90 degree corner or that, you know, that steep corner at Danville and it went right off the edge of the trestle. And that was it. That was the end of the old 97. Uh, so, you know, it's funny that that happened, you know, well over a hundred years ago and we're still singing that song today. So uh, there you go. There is a little history for you this morning. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great Sunday.